Hello everyone, Pentef here today for an exciting news concerning the upcoming German collector tier 10 tank, the VK9001P. I know that the tank has already been announced for a month by Wargaming, so most of you already know about its existence, but maybe you don't know yet what to expect about this tank, and that's exactly the point of this video. Wargaming released a small clip showing the tank, so I'm gonna let you watch it and we will talk about it after, so enjoy! From this short clip, there are a few things we can highlight. The first one is, to stay on World of Tank Blitz, the close look between this tier 10 and the tier 9 German tank, the VK4502B. This similarity allows us to imagine that both of these tanks have the same gameplay, meaning this tank should be a perfect choice for city battles, as well as any side scrape positions. And as both of the tanks are quite similar, I think we can highlight all the main characteristics of the new tier 10 from the VK4502B. What do I mean by that? Uh, well, I think that the tier 10 is just gonna be the tier 9, but with some perks boosted because it's a tier 10. For example, I'm pretty sure you're gonna have a bad mobility as all the VKs have. Also a great armor because it's a German heavy tank after all. And uh, for the alpha damage, I think we can have both uh, 440 alpha damage or 640. It's gonna depend on what Wargaming is planning to do with this tank. Uh, we can't be 100% sure for the moment, but I doubt they will go for a higher caliber gun. So yeah, 640 or 440. But in my opinion, I think Wargaming is gonna go for a lower gun and not the big one you have on the E100 or the VK7201K for example, because if we take a look at the video, we can clearly see that the gun is much smaller than the one you already have on the E100 for example. Really, uh, I think it's a good thing, because we will have a tier 10 heavy German tank which doesn't have a big gun, uh, it's gonna be... I think the same as the one you already have on the mouse, but with a better reload time, which is quite interesting because it's gonna give us a new type of gameplay concerning German EV, so it's gonna be a second breath and I'm glad they go for it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this quick little review of the upcoming VK9001P. If that's the case, feel free to subscribe, like and share, and don't forget you're not here to be better, but to be the best. Pentoof, over.